Also, I just want to let you know I don't like this hat. I had to buy the hat. It's not my fault. I don't look my best right now. I can't always look my best. Hola, soy Margarita. And bienvenido, sa El Mirador de Mario Montenegro. Ah. It's supposed to be a beautiful view of the lake and you can't see nada. Get the, get the view, Caitlin. Get the view. There's nothing. We just walked for two hours uphill and there's nothing here. We had a better view when we were down at the bottom. And yet, here we are. Oh my god. Hola, disculpe. Is that a soccer field? It's a huge soccer field. Caitlin Socio bailed on us. <laughs> so well, now we gotta walk three miles down. And then we asked Piper's, uh, we asked Piper's co-worker. We said, can you come help us out? He said, uh, can you just get a taxi? <laughs> oh, do you see how much I'm sweating? Wait, wait, watch out. No. Oh, for Jesus. I'm trying to make friends in some Pongo. And so the other day, a girl my age, well, 18 years old, a little young, she invited me to go to church. Why anyone would do that, I have no idea. And I was like, you know what? I need to make friends. So I'll go to church. And I show up outside the church, and she's like, you're not wearing black. In Guatemala. Oh. Oh. Okay, volcano. Sheesh. I'm like, why would I be wearing black? <laughs> and she was like, because today is Jesus' funeral. I didn't know that. Nobody told me that. Why would you invite me to Jesus' funeral? I don't even know him like that. <laughs> I don't even know him like that. You are in tight like that. I walk in this church and everybody is wearing black. <laughs> I'm wearing a red flowy skirt, a skin tight white tank top with my boobs out. I don't get a lot, but I got enough for Jesus to notice. <laughs> And I got a straw hat. It's just like naked people. That's what I was doing. I thought, oh, okay, I've embarrassed myself enough today. Wrong. 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 Is this like a farm? Oh my god. What, the stream? Oh, this is the irrigation. Oh. She was like, you want to come to the front to see some more? Sure, let's go to the front. I don't really want to, but sure. So we walked to the front. And then I realized that we're in line to stand in front of the giant Jesus statue in front of the church, for, in front of everybody. Every single person in all of Guatemala is here. In front of the Jesus statue, everybody's doing that cross thing. <laughs> I've never done that in my life. And I wasn't about to start practicing in front of all of some fongo. I was dying of laughter. Jesus was dying. I was dying. In the tuk tuk. In the tuk tuk. Video, video. Just look at that. That's cool. Just in the middle of the yard. Me. I don't know if that's insensitive. I really can't tell. <laughs> well, Jesus is dead, so. Yeah, he's dead. He didn't come back, did he? No. I don't know. Well, he famously got resurrected. When it's my turn to go up front, all I do is I go like this. And then I walk away. I'm getting exocommunicated from the church. I don't want to be there. What a good view of the mirror door. Yeah, yeah, wow. Well. My new favorite food here is the peanut butter and jelly tortilla. And people hate that. Hate that. Hate that. To my class, I told them my favorite food right now is a tortilla with peanut butter and jelly. And they were stunned to silence. Dang, look at that Hugo de Papaya. Yeah. There's no view, we're gonna stand in this shed instead. What a cool shed, it smells like this. It smells a little bit like pee, I'm gonna be honest. But the thing is, people eat tortillas with everything here. They eat it with mashed potatoes, they eat it with chow mein and ketchup. Peanut butter and jelly is not that weird. But when I tell them, it looks like they're about to throw up in their mouths. Video moment, and wait, it's a video. Oh, tortillas. And then on TikTok, I posted that video. It's just hate comments. They're like, you're gentrifying Guatemala with your peanut butter and jelly tortillas. All right. 
I won't eat them anymore. Sometimes you gotta bring your own toilet paper here to the bathroom. And sometimes I just forget it. And sometimes I remember that I forget it before I even pee. And I'm just like, I don't wanna go get it. I'm too lazy to go get it. So in, instead of using paper, I just kegel. But I gotta stop doing that, cause I'm gonna get a rash. I spent 800 Q on Skechers. No, not these. Don't look at these either. Didn't you have Skechers before? No one I'm gonna be honest with you. No one I'm gonna be honest with you. No one I'm gonna be honest with you. My first day, I started teaching in the big school, the Ineb. Sorry, it's my belly button out. I was writing on the board, and then I tried to erase it, and I realized I could not erase it. And I had used permanent marker on this whiteboard. All I do is ruin things. I come to Guatemala and I gentrify Guatemala with my PB&J tortilla. I come and I destroy their whiteboard. Then it was me and the teacher like spinning on the whiteboard trying to get off the permanent marker. And the children were just like, what is your problem? Oh wow, more boats. People hate that. <laughs>